Dr. Benio's log number 392. I have ordered a custom-made special hazmat suit with bunny ears and appropriate mask in order to check on Portia. Perhaps they should call me Dr. Bunnyo. And then I enter very gravely and cautiously. Portia? Oh, Portia, how you doing? I'm checking up on you. Are you still sick? You need to take your temperature. Lipstick all over face. Is this day number four or five? I, I, I can't remember. Are you okay? <laughs> now this sounds very serious, Portia. I'm very sorry for you. The prognosis is negative. Wait, positive. I think in the medical community, positive means bad, right? You are positive for marijuana. We must take you in. I know, this is very terrible. This mask is an N95, so I can't catch it. But my hands are never going to touch you. <laughs> are you even wearing any lipstick now? Are you okay? I know, I know. But keep fighting. Often, the key to survival is the will to live. So, uh, good luck. Perhaps... There is only one thing I can do to help her. I'll get her some vitamin C. That's all I can prescribe to you. Vitamin C laced with laudanum. She'll be fine in a jiffy. Go to the gas station, fill up my can, and then grab the medicine. I need these pills, okay? I'll buy. The worst part is Portia hasn't been able to participate in the flower fest, planting flowers around her house. All right, Portia. I prescribe to you these laudanum pills laced with, uh, vitamin C. Or was that the other way around? I can't remember. And, uh, what else was I doing? I don't remember. Need medicine? You must take these. And you will hopefully just feel a little better. <laughs> Why do you say, Mew? You're not a cat. Well, that prescription, laudanum must have really worked. You did a backflip all of a sudden. Right away. I know you're still sad, but give it a week or two, because uh, it usually lasts two, two weeks. I didn't want to have you, you know, stay sick for that long. Potentially infect others, including myself. Also, I found out Boone is moving. I got something to say to you. Good riddance. Bye-bye. And that, my friends, is why he's leaving town. Nobody wants to deal with his weirdness. Gabby! Gabby, where are you? Gabby! Gabor? Where is you, Gabby? Oh, there you are. Notice anything different, Gabby? I'm sure you did. Perhaps now I can finally understand what goes on in your brain. That's right. Like, hi. It's me, Benio. What is it? Fine, what is it? What are you gonna ask? No, I don't want to. I'll see you later. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Sounds like fun. I didn't even have a, an exclamation point after that. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Are you sick too? Do you have the fever? I don't understand. The hat didn't work. Time to go a digging for trouble. I hate this. It's ugly. I pulled it. Hey, I took it with me. Oh, I can steal flowers from people's houses? <laughs> well, nobody will be the wiser. This is perfect. I got my plan now. This is how I'm going to win the flower fest. Look at Mitzi. Well, this is ugly. Um. Hmm, what kind of flowers do I want this time around? Oh, Mitzi will never miss this. <laughs> Agent S was already suspicious that I would do something, so, uh... I ain't gonna steal from her today. I'll take that one, too. This is perfect! And I can go around selling them, too, as well. Very good. One here, too. So if I need to, I can always sabotage other people's gardens. Beautiful. Oh, I can dig. Like Diglett. 
Well, Boone, since you're leaving, I might as well take your flowers. Thanks. I wonder if they will ever figure it out. Perfect. Now we're cooking with fire. We are taking over. Take you, and you too. Nothing better than stealing flowers from people. Blathers, figure out this fossil. Take it. Oh, I got it already. I can sell it. See you later. Jerk. I just noticed I look like that kid from Adventure Time. I want to sell. Give me my money. Perfect. I'm basically swapping dinosaur bones for paying my mortgage. Three thousand. Now give me my furniture. Time to check up on my winnings. It's an encyclopedia set, but it's missing the first four volumes. Let's take a look at this piano. I hate it. It's what you gotta love about dumpster diving. Let's roll. No! I said, it's my welcome mat. There. What is it, Frigga? It depends. Are you giving it for free or are you charging me for it? That's highway robbery, Frigga. No thanks. Fine. Give it! No! <laughs> I got it for free! <laughs> Mitzi, what is it? <laughs> I forgot I gave her that phrase. I know how you love these, so here it comes. Oh, great. I like to always answer with enemies. Well, you've just made one today, Mitzi. Gabby? Gabor? Yes. It is so awesome. Speak to me! <laughs> no! That reminds me, I have to water my flowers. Not just plant them. Good golly! You just made a huge mistake, Gabby. Helping me win the contest. I want to sell. See you later. I guess I can take this mask off and put my glasses back on. But I want to keep the hat, because my hair is light brown. And I'm so ashamed because that's not my real hair color. Time to water. Life for you? Life for you? Would you aim correctly? Alright, I think I got them both. And you? And orange? And tulip? And red? I said in red? And you? Not the fence, please. The flower? Drink up. You're gonna win me that prize. All in a day's work, fellas. Now I can finally rest easy. Well, all y'all, we did it. We gained the advantage in the flower fest by stealing flowers and helped Portia out of her quarantine. Hopefully she'll be better in no time and non-contagious. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye bye